All right, a little quick video here on what I think is a ripoff. Lady bought it anyway, and the reason she bought it is because she sees on the container kills 12 months, 365. Kills vegetation for up to 12 months. It doesn't kill but one time. That's what's crazy. People waste their money on this product. It is two products in one. It's the same chemical used in this Roundup as is in this Roundup. However, this Roundup has a pre-emergent. Now, if you read on the back, right there it says important. Uh, if you're spraying a bed, you have to, to spray the entire bed, whether there's weeds in it or not, to make this product effective. And even then, if you scratch the surface of the dirt after you spray this, it will penetrate the coating that the pre-emergent laid down and then weeds will germinate. The 365 is the pre-emergent, the 12 months, and that it will not kill anything. It just prevents we uh, seeds from germinating. Now, if it grows back from a root, it's not going to do any good. It's great for cracks in driveways and patios and stuff like that. Uh, if you got a lot of grass growing over it, you go over it real good with a. Uh, the Roundup will kill the grass and the pre-emergent goes down in the cracks and will help prevent weeds for quite a while. Now this is the kicker. She bought this product to use at her mom and dad's house and I tried to explain to her that this product is better than that product for what she wanted and it would be more economical but she says use it anyway. Well here's what she stated in the note that she gave me about spraying Roundup. She wants to do some heavy duty weed killing. Okay, here's what she said. Be sure to spray more than you normally do. Well, you're not supposed to over apply chemicals. You can spray the heck out of it with Roundup and it's only gonna do so much. She even stated, not in writing, but verbally, she said, I don't want the weeds to grow back. Well, I'm in a little predicament here because now I'm going to go over and if I were to try to do this the way this is supposed to be used, I will use way more than this 1.3 gallons. Matter of fact, I'd probably end up using seven or eight gallons maybe more I don't know how much that costs but I would say it's a considerable amount and she's gonna to be totally disappointed when I go over there and spray all the weeds I can and use up all of this product and then I have to go to this product and in six months three months two months well it's gonna get cold so the weeds are gonna quit growing here in a few weeks or a couple of months because it's the end of August now, so we don't have much season left, and that might be my savior. But unless, like I said, unless I spray the entire bed with this product, it's not going to stop weeds from coming up. So, therefore, she's going to be disappointed when I do spray and weeds do come back, and I promise you they will. So... My two cents on this product is don't buy it. Buy this product. Don't buy the pre-mixed with this sprayer. It's a waste of money. Get yourself a cheap $19 pump-up sprayer, one gallon, and buy yourself concentrated Roundup if you choose to use Roundup. And mix your own. It's far more economical. You get way more uh, product it goes a lot further if you use the Roundup Concentrate and mix it yourself. 
again, I don't know what this costs, but I would say it's knocking at least $20 easy. I would be closer guessing like 25 maybe even 30 um, so there you go my two cent on a roundup max control 365 in all premixed roundups but anyway that's my opinion like it or not